Hey, Kowalski here. Weird camera angle, but why not? We'll let this one slide. So, you know, uh, oops, 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 okay. Wrong scenes, you just got to see a little bit, um, but you already saw those in other videos. But okay, um, well, come, cutting straight to the cheese. So, did, did this FM just have a stroke? Like, I'm playing an FM here, rated 2017 in bullet. Well, you cannot see it, so I'm gonna go here. You see, and this guy's rating is 2217, mine was 2213, and it's about the same. So, I, and this is just freshly played, these games. And, um, well, you know, like, what, what even did he play? Uh, so, so he lost, obviously, but, um, I mean, just, just look at this. Hold on, let me, let me just find my headphones. So that I, I like I like to to hear the sound of uh, like pieces clicking. So uh, you know I want you to hear that uh, crisp as well. So um, this is actually the second game that we played. So this is a little bit more normal, and uh, and I'm actually gonna have an evaluation so that you can see it. And um, you know this is like a pretty normal Karokan. This is a variation that I I like to play. H6 now you gotta go bishop h7. I mean this is all pretty known. Here you take the bishop and you go for the move e6 this has been played before definitely this is the classical variation the main line and now here there are some variations but bishop e7 is a move now um here we can transpose a little bit to some other games and uh, you know this is kind of the main line that's why i'm not losing a lot of time here now queen d5 has historically been played here but this is of course a bullet game so i'm gonna play knight to d5 and uh, here, you know, I, I started like trying to, to launch some sort of an attack. White is better. Okay, I go castles. And here something really um, weird happened. So, you know, it all, it all looks like a normal game. Uh, B5, and this is basically the best move. And I found it in um, <clears throat> two seconds. <laughs> Uh, and uh, here um, I just uh, took on c4 again the best move and um, here what I had to do is um, go knight into d3 this would have been just amazing just superb but instead I went c5 and now after a few exchanges well I am completely winning uh, because right here all I have to do is play g6 and I'm winning but I play c takes on d4 and now, well, uh, I mean, it's, it's it's a draw. And now he can mate me, and he doesn't find it. Surprisingly, he doesn't find it. This is this is still mate. So I play f6. He takes. So you know, this is still leading into mate. This is mate in five. Um, and you know, check. He finds this rook g7 here would have been the the right check. So rook g7. That's how the mate goes. Queen c5. Or if I go back, oh you no, know, that's that's. I oh, know rook f7 I can do this and then here then he has like rook b7 check and then this or this okay so that's the mate but he goes bishop c5 and now it's a draw again and here I'm actually winning but now he gets a check picks up my queen but now it's still not winning enough because look at the time he has six seconds and he misses here rook to d1 and uh, um, you know here he just resigns and um, you know this this game was uh, definitely a roller coaster and it definitely came down to time but what made me do this video is the very first game that we played now the very first game okay so that you can uh, kind of focus um, on what I'm trying to do ended like this and I had the white pieces and now you might ask yourself well you're not that good how did you manage to just smash an FM in 25 moves and then plus 36 points of material? This is not your normal win against an FM. Maybe this would have been your normal win, but this is just, I mean, crazy. So uh, everything uh, we open up and I, I thought, you know, he was disrespecting, but uh, you know, title players can disrespect because they're title players. I mean, that's, uh, you know, they, they are allowed to do that. So, um, you know, he disrespected, obviously I got the center, I played it in normal fashion and uh, here he even gave me a pawn. Now he's just completely dead lost, but I thought, you know, maybe he wanted to do some sort of experiment. So I jump in and he plays d6 and that's where he just didn't sit right with me at all. So he gave up all of this, all of this, nine points of material and then he plays queen f3. What? 
Wait, what? And that, that's, that, that just made me ask, did this guy just have a stroke? I mean, did he just have a stroke? Legit. I mean, and then I just beat him, right? I just made him. What? What did just happen? Okay, and I'm, you know, that, that's it for the video. I'm not gonna make it any longer. You guys decide. Did this Grandmaster just go insane? What happened to him? Uh, not, not Grandmaster, Fide Master, but, but still. I mean, you know. Okay. Oski out. See you in the next one.